Is there not? Here's how you, that's right. If people say they like Sting, they don't react the same way. They say, do you like Sting? You go, yeah, he's nice, he's cute. Even you too, great band, but you too, I love him. But when we metal brothers see each other, you like metal, we don't go, yeah, we go, yeah. Metal, yeah, yeah. Ooh, that's metal. And at the end of the day, I have children, and I watch my children into the wiggles. For us, metal is grown-up wiggles. You come see Iron Maiden, you want to see Eddie, no? I want to see that red Here comes Eddie, holy shit. I want to see ACDC. Brian Johnson is 63 years old. 63. Talking about. When I was about to like, shoot the trail, way to kill. Angus Young is 64. <laughs> Do you know anybody 64 years old? that acts anything close to that? My mom is 64. She's like, can you pass the cheese? Can you pour more wine, please? This guy's 64 going, shoot the trail, where the care? <laughs> Ozzy Osbourne, the greatest wiggle of all. No one knows what Ozzy's saying, but who cares? Okay, he's nice, young, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead, right? <laughs> Sharon's on the side. Will you sing the lyrics, Ozzy? They just want to hear the song. They don't care, Sharon. <laughs> Ozzy would be great waiting in line to return something. Or in a GPS. Calculating route. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sure. You not sure you go. Where are we going? Like you click on the Brian Johnson one that'll say, We're in the hell! We're in the hell! <laughs> or you can pick on the James Hetfield one that'll just always tell you going the right way. Am I going right? Yeah. Yeah. Should I turn down here? Yeah. Uh oh, I think it's the wrong turn. Ooh. <laughs> I tell you what, metal for kids. How great would ACDC be with any child song, any child song. Give them hokey pokey. 
and they rip it up. It come out. Put your left foot in. Ooh. Put your left foot out. Come on. ABCs. You know, you know you A, B. Ozzy can sing London Bridge. London Bridge you are falling down, falling down, falling down. It's falling down. <laughs> Judas Priest could do Humpty Dumpty. Had a great fall, had a great fall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall, had a great fall. There was Humpty Dumpty climbing up the wall. <laughs> I don't know where this is, baby. But here's the greatest thing about metal. We are, look around, this is our generation that's going to grow old together. And we are the first generation where metal will be oldies music. Yeah, and I don't know about you, but I can't wait to the day where I'm in the back seat of my grandchildren's car, telling them, God, will you turn on grandpa's damn channel? Show some respect. My grandkids are going to go, don't turn it on, Mom. It sounds like animals are sacrificing themselves. But I'll be in the back seat just like all of you one day with your little grandchildren next to you, and you're going to hear something like this. Hey, here's all the old metalheads out there turning 85. This is an old one back in the 80s. This is for you. This is Metallica's Creeping Death. You'll be in the back seat. Die! 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 Because I'm creeping dead! You'll be in that back seat smacking your old grandkids in the head. You hear that? That's music right there talking about creeping death. That's real. That's real. Yeah! 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 Ooh! <laughs> Which are old people's homes, my mom, I tell you this, many of you, your parents will get old and you don't think about it, but my mom is really old now, and she's, we had to put her in a, a place where there's other older people, and I go there and I see where she plays bingo and all these games, but for us metalheads, when we're old and we're in a home, we're going to have Everyone gather in the lobby. It's time for a wheelchair mosh pitting. You and your old friends, all right, line up your wheelchair and smack into each other hard. Nuts are in fair play. Be on the floor. Can I help you? Don't touch me. This is how we did it. I'm metal for crying out loud. I can crap by myself. <laughs> yeah! Let's do something fun right here. Give me a heartbeat, Mike. This is Mike, my drummer. of mine and I was not allowed to I was a young boy 
I was 14. And my mom looked at me and she said, I don't know who you're staying out with tonight, but whoever it is, you make sure you are no later than 11 p.m. tonight. 11? Mom, they're all allowed to stay out to midnight, 1 a.m. They're gonna call me crazy names like faggot and stuff. I can't, I can't come home at 11. And my mom looked at me and she said, you will be home when I tell you to be home. Do you understand me? You're 14 years old. I don't know where you're going, but I can tell you this. When it's nighttime, that's when trouble starts. You will be home when I tell you to be home, as long as you live in my house and me and your father work for you. When you're alone and you want to be out in the streets, you do as you please. But right now, you live in my home and you will be home no later than 11. Do you hear me? All right. I said, do you hear me? I said, all right. But most important when you go out tonight, no drinking, drinking, drink. Mom, I would never drink. You know that. But we all know what's going to happen this night, don't you? Don't you? As soon as your friends pick you up, they're waiting for you. You get in the back seat in the car and they got cool as a beer. And they just, they just look at you and they go, I hope you're allowed to stay out real late tonight because I can tell you right now, we're gonna be real late tonight. And you look at them and go, whoa, whoa, whoa. How late are we talking? And they look you dead in the face and they tell you it's gonna be at least 4 a.m. Is Godzilla breaking in today? Are we all right? <laughs> this shit ain't gonna blow up, is it? Is it my ass? Is there a head? There would be, little do you know, that's our pyrokeptics. Right in the middle of 4 a.m., this blows up. <laughs> oh, you're the guy to help, thank you. I feel much better. So next thing you know, you've been drinking with your friends. Rule number one, never pass out in front of your friends. Because if you do, they get a magic marker and they draw on your face. And as the night goes on, they trump you on your front lawn. And there you are in your... Is that you? Anytime you can, it's all good. Meantime, I don't know what's going on. All I can tell you is this would have never happened if it was a to show. Hey, let's go and have a show to do. You ready? <laughs> this would have never happened to the scorpions. I'm just trying to tell these people a story and you're royally fucking it up. <laughs> but it's all good. Are we better? Shall we continue? Are you still with me? Thank you for your patience, girl. Girl. Ooh. You're with your friends. They dump you off right in the front lawn. And you're wasted. And you're talking to your friends. Listen, listen. I was supposed to be home yesterday. So you gotta do me a big favor. Don't make any noise as I try to get into my house. Cause I don't wanna wake up my mom at 4 a.m. When I've been drinking and I'm 14, that's like waking up a demon. So please. And 
and you look at your friends. Two seconds, two seconds, two seconds. And you open the door and you look at your friends. I'm in. I'll call you tomorrow, tomorrow. And your friends, this is your friends. They look at you and they go, see you tomorrow. Beep. Beep. Hope your mom don't wake up tonight. Get into your bedroom. The problem is you're 14 and you've been drinking. So things are wobbling. And you gotta pass your mom. You don't wanna pass your mom at 4 a.m. Wake her up, that's like waking up a demon. And you can hear her snoring as you go past her room. She I know he's just about making to the bed and my dog would wake up. A German Shepherd dog. I'd be like, Uns German, is that you? <laughs> All the Germans like, we don't sound like that. He sounds ridiculous. Uns German, is that you? Trying to get by uns me, are you? Mother would be quite upset if I uns bark right now. You smell like alcohol, and it says I am a dick on your face. And you tell the dog, listen, listen, don't tell mom. Tomorrow, we'll go play stick. Just me and you, if you just do this solid and be quiet for me. Can you do that? Just be quiet, and we'll play stick tomorrow in the park. And the dog goes, you want me to be quiet so we can play stick? Tomato in the park? Tell me, will it always be like when we play stick? When you take your stick and you bring me to the park and you uns pretend to throw it? And I look like an uns asshole running around looking for the stick? While you and your friends smoke the dope and laugh at me? Here is your quiet! Jim's home and he's banged up for 4 a.m. I'm all 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 banged up. Now your mom's up. This is what you didn't want. <laughs> Trying to get by me, are you? You, 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 you smell like alcohol. Oh, oh, oh. How do you do that echo? When did you grow that tail? I'm gonna ask you something. And you better not lie, 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 lie. All right, no more, no more echo. How many drinks did you have? And you look your mom right in the face. I swear to God, swear to God, I had one drink.
Yeah. I have something for everyone here. It has been seen on YouTube. It's called Party in the Stomach. And I'm going to help everyone in here how not to make uh, uh, an ass of yourself and how not to get sick if you drink. This is a metal celebration, so some of us are drinking. Yeah? Are we drinking? Okay. Remember, when you drink, it's no different than having a party. But the party is in your stomach. And your stomach is the bouncer, he's security. You don't want to make security angry. So when you have a party, you invite your friends and family so everyone gets along. You cannot mix alcohol. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Now you, <laughs> he said, no. We'll see you later. I should have said yes. I'm gonna help you, brother. The only, <laughs> the only alcohol you can mix is beer. Because beer know each other. They get along, yeah! Beer gets along. Beer shows up at the stomach. Ready and they're knocking on the door. He's here, he's here. Everyone just do as I say. And the stomach answers. What's going on? And the beer goes, listen, we just want to have a good time. It's just us beer. We don't want to start any trouble. You know everyone. You know Heineken. Uns hello. Don't do that. Don't do that. We're not allowed to do that. <laughs> here's, here's Bex. Uns. I just said don't do that. It's Budweiser, Guinness. Time for the Martin to you. And the stomach goes, all right, come on in. But the beer goes, are you sure we can come in? Because there's about 40 of us. And the stomach goes, come on in, but keep it down and don't start trouble. But now you have a party. And friends find out about the party and they want to crash it. So now vodka shows up. And one thing, never invite scotch. Scotch is trouble. Where are you, Scotchman? You're trouble. Soon as they get into the stomach, soon as they show up at the stomach, they're like, I heard you got a great party on in here. I brought some bagpipers. As soon as Scotch gets in the stomach, they're looking for trouble. Ah, uh, look right there, look, look, look. Daddy, hey, Heineken, Heineken, right here, you filthy wanker. I don't like her, but now shots are showing up. Jägermeister, Goldschlager, <laughs> Gold <laughs> Fuzzy Navels, <laughs> Saki. Oh, how'd you got big party here? Big party here. The party should end. But it doesn't because at the end of the night, what alcohol always shows up? What alcohol always shows up? What alcohol always shows up? Tequila! And tequila never shows up alone. There's always eight or nine of them. And your stomach goes, listen, listen, Pedro, back up. It's a little late, can't let you in. But tequila is persistent. Come on, man, we won't stand no trouble, man. We came here to have a good time. We let the worm in the van. But then a minute, yet then a minute, man. And like a dummy, your stomach lets in one shot of tequila. And then they do what they always do in America. They sneak in all their friends when no one's looking. <laughs> come on, ain't nobody looking. Come on, come on, get the worm. Let's have a good time. And 
wants to kill us in the stomach. Like, who wants to have a party? <laughs> Fights break out. Fuzzy navels are getting it on. And that's when your stomach goes, that's it. Everyone's got to get out. Ham and eggs, you're first. Let's go. Excuse me, not that way, the way he came in. Let's go. There's always a stubborn old hot dog. I've been here for nine years. <laughs> and if your stomach's really mad at you, he throws your air out. Are you all right? <laughs> Facebook, faggot. Psst. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> um, should we uh, do the, let's do, let's do a fun one and then do bingo. All right, we got two last ones for you. I want you to repeat a, hey, 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 metal's alive. Meadows alive. Hey, 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 meadows alive. Meadows alive. Hey, 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 meadows alive. Meadows alive. Nice, let's do this. That's a friend of mine, and I'll listen to it anytime. But when we need to amp it up, we find our metal and we crank it up so high. That's when heads are banging, fist are pumping, metal's alive, metal's alive. Heads are banging, fist are pumping, metal's alive, metal's alive. When heads are banging, fist are pumping, metal's alive, metal's alive. I said, hey, 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 metal's alive. Metal's alive, I said, hey, 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 metal's alive, it's alive. Pumping. 
your life! Yeah, that was fun. This last one, we really need your help. We're gonna change metal for children. We're gonna take a classic metal song. No, we're gonna take the song Bingo. And we're gonna metal it up. The normal bingo goes, I knew a farmer had a dog. Bingo was his name, oh, hey. I-N-G-O, hey, I-N-G-O, hey, I-N-G-O, and Bingo was his name, oh. And the second round is, hey, hey, N-G-O, hey, hey, N-G-O, hey, hey, N-G-O, and Bingo was his, and the third round is, hey, 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 until we all do haze. That's cute when you're a child. But right now we are METAL! And it's time to METAL UP! Let's do this! Now we can drive in our cars with our children and they can bang their heads with us and they'll go to sleep a lot quicker. We can start off with Ozzy. I knew the father, he had it done. starts falling asleep in the back.
What's the name? I said, What's the name of that dog? And the old farmer man stood up all and proud. With his farmer voice, he said, Real, real loud. Bingo is his name. For, for giving me respect. Thank you, Long Live Metal and Comedy. Thank you.